Hello, people who own EDS eleven. Today I'm gonna spend um, about twenty minutes to show you how to resolve this error message. I purchased my EDS eleven from uh, BNH Photo. When I had this problem, I contact them. They don't want to help me or either they don't know what to do they recommend me to contact EDS directly they gave me the phone number which is I'm already have the phone number I call EDS they don't seem to want to help because for them to help you have to pay their uh, technical service uh, membership fee okay so I sent the email and it went a week, no answer, okay? So I wasn't able to use for three, four weeks. But I was able to use prior to I encountered this problem, okay? Today I'm gonna show you how you resolve this error message it is couple steps but I don't know maybe you guys uh, are very technical skill but for me I don't but um, I just fix myself I figure out myself okay cuz I been uh, uh do a lot of uh editing so i wanted to get this thing uh result so i dig out myself and i found the problem and i fixed the problem let me show you how to solve the problem okay all right the first step is to come down here and then you see there's a EDS 11 setup manager icon here you want to right click here and you want to get out from here so that way when you go f to fix a problem in the next step it won't have problem okay so I did my reason so I'm not gonna do for you okay I just show you how you fix okay Okay, the next step is to go into your C drive and then you're gonna go all the way to your window, okay? And then you're gonna go to the system 32, okay? All right, so you're gonna go until you see your system 32 right here. Okay. And then you see your you go into your system thirty two. You're gonna scroll down, and you see driver here. Go into here. And then you're gonna see the etc photos. Click that. Sorry. Okay, okay, sorry, all right. Now you see it. All right, so then when you go into your ETC folder, you, some of you may have more files in here, in this folder, under this folder. You wanna highlight all the folder under this folder and delete it. Sometimes you may not able to delete every, every files from here, but if you can, you're gonna go to this three dots here, click there, and then you're gonna go to options. And this is called the photo options, okay? And you click there, and it'll bring you this photo options, okay? And then you're gonna click view. Then down here, you see the hidden files and folders 
if if perhaps your is in highlight on this this one don't show hidden files in photo then and then you're gonna highlight the show hidden files in folder here then you're gonna click OK okay but like I said before I did my already so I don't want to do it again okay all right so once that you once you're that done you click OK all right and then you're coming back okay you're gonna go back and then you can try to uh, delete again if it doesn't if it doesn't allow you to do don't worry I'm gonna show you how you get this thing work okay so you're gonna uh, go back to your uh, C drive okay okay you're gonna go back to your C drive okay I'm holding my uh, my phone okay <laughs> I don't have the holder so this all right so you're gonna go back to your C drive and then let's see if I can go back here probably not in here okay all right so you're gonna go back to your C drive and then you can go to your programs file okay you're gonna go to your program program files okay sorry okay Bear with me. Probably not in here. Probably in the next. The next. Okay, right here. So you're gonna come down to your program files here. Okay. And then you will see your grass valley folders here. So what you need to do is just go inside here. Okay. And then you will see there's a chorus hop click there and you see all these uh, EH photos okay all right so you want to highlight all these photos and delete it okay delete okay delete all this photo if any way you cannot delete all this photo I'm gonna show you the next step to so let it let you delete all this photo okay because this photo contain many files under the photos and some of the files are running in behind the scene and you don't know and you don't see it okay so let me show you the next step okay okay how I got here so you wanna uh, when you are heat push down uh, alt key control key and delete and you you're gonna see the uh, task managers uh, screen then you're gonna come you will click there and then it will bring you this uh, screen this screen is called a test manager screen some of some of some of those uh, some of you may know how to get here okay some of those um, may know more than me okay so when you come down here you want to click service okay then you will see all this file are uh, running okay but you don't care about you don't do anything on this but you're gonna go all the way to until you see all this eh okay eh uh files that is running you see is running here so you're gonna right click on there and then you're gonna say stop 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 okay you click stop all the files that has eh uh, name okay or I should say EH files okay these file are running behind the scene and that's why you can't delete uh, inside the um, um, chorus hub folders 
and then the grass valley is folded okay so once you stop all this you're gonna go back to your um, grass valley um, folder and you should be able to de delete all the uh, EH uh, folder in there okay so I did my like that it works just fine okay it doesn't have any issue with the uh, when I try to open the EDSC 11 to you so all right so uh, this is the way that I fix my problem then once you uh, once you on it delete all this file you're going to um, turn on your computer and let it sit for a few minutes and then you turn on your computer and you run your uh, EDS 11 I'm sure it's gonna fix the problem okay but if it doesn't then I don't know but I got my working again by doing the way I show you okay and this is only on window 11 okay I don't know window 10 or something or what other version uh, window version I don't know so I fixed my problem by doing the way I show you uh, and then I got an email from EDS because before that I sent them an email about this issue and the person who sent me the email say I need to take a picture of the problem I need to explain them how I got this problem blah 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 and then I replies that email say I don't need your help anymore your assistant is not good very hard to get a contact or get a hold of you guy in the past EDS 7 to 10 I don't have a problem with this and I also contact uh, EDS support center or customer center talk to them was easy okay but when it come to EDS 11 not very helpful so I don't need your help anymore so and the guy respond back to me sorry blah blah like this but I don't even care anymore so all right I hope this helped you if it doesn't like I say if it doesn't help you I don't know because I'm not a technical uh, person I don't have any technical skill I know a little bit only so um, like I say, if it doesn't help you, you might want to contact EDS right away. And the reason I keep having, um, I'm the reason I'm a little bit upset is that you go into the um, YouTube, you search, nobody show you how to uh, resolve the issue. You go to the EDS forums that people come and post and uh, talks about what problem they have about EDS 11. People talk about a little bit, but not very helpful. And uh, they don't show you how to step by step, how to get this thing resolved. So, all right. So I hope this again, I hope this help you. Take care. God bless you.